In 2009, the city of Shoreview, Minnesota, installed innovative pervious pavements in its Woodbridge neighborhood to help keep pollutants out of nearby Owasso Lake. These porous roadways allow stormwater to filter down through the pavement instead of running off the surface to storm drains and the lake. Minnesota DOT and the Local Road Research Board undertook a multi-year research study to evaluate how well the new type of pavement worked. The study is really important because there haven't been a lot of permeable pavements installed in this market as public infrastructure. And so I believe practitioners are looking for this sort of information uh, should they be considering the use of a permeable pavement. Shoreview poured a 7-inch pervious concrete pavement over 18 inches of crushed rock and gravel that retains the stormwater as it seeps into the soil. Regular vacuuming keeps the surface pores unclogged. MnDOT researchers tested the pavement's performance over several years for water absorption, sound absorption, and ride quality. They found that the pervious pavement in Shoreview not only continued to drain stormwater effectively, it was also quieter and smoother riding than a traditional pavement. Researchers pointed to the pervious pavement's superior stormwater handling and lower life cycle costs as compared to traditional drainage structures. They found the new pavement type as an alternative worth considering for city streets, even without calculating the expected benefit of pollution reduction and improved compliance with the Clean Water Act. Uh, I believe the value of the study is that it, uh, it demonstrates that the permeable pavement was a valid approach to solving a particular type of public infrastructure challenge. Mm -hmm.